I'm stuck. Oh no! Oh no, not again. I did it again. I did it again! Drill ship under attack? Oh, this is not a good time for that. This is not. Oh my god, okay. Guys, Dre here, and welcome back to Volcanoids. Today, we're going to obviously be digging around this volcanic world and hopefully unlocking some more of the secrets of this interesting island. So, if you missed the first episode, we built this thing. Well, we didn't build the whole thing, to be fair. We fixed this thing, and now we have a drilling rig of our own. I gotta say, it looks pretty damn awesome, and we just installed a turret on it to keep us safe. Now that we have that turret, I think I might actually go explore a little bit, just because we didn't really do that in the first episode, and I want to see if maybe we can loot something off of these robots that are around here. Like I said, they hang around volcanoes. I see some smoke up ahead, so we should see some guys over here, I'm assuming. And maybe we can get some good loot off them. Now, we are supposed to be doing some quests right now. Uh, supposed to talk to the radio, but being that the uh, ship is fixed, we should be able to go down with ease, so we don't have to worry too much as long as we're in the volcano within the 10 minutes that this thing is about to erupt. So yeah, we got these little robot dudes. I saw these guys in the last episode. I didn't really come over and bother them, though. Now I want to! So let's go see. They seem to be really fast, and that's kind of scary. You know what? Being that he's running away from me, let's get some of this sulfur ore, because we're going to need some more of that. And here they come. Now we got two here. I'm a little worried. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, got one. All right, so they, they only take two shots. That's not bad. But they do have long range on them, too. So we just got two of them. Let me see. Oh, 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 okay. Sorry, I didn't see you there. I don't know why I'm, I, I'm apologizing to you. You're freaking shooting me. Goddamn Canadian in me. All right, it's copper plates. So, yeah, looks like we can loot some of this stuff. Unfortunately, I have a full inventory. I didn't plan this out. Breach replacement, that's actually really good. Let's get rid of the repair kit for right now. And, well, we need copper, but... I would rather get some of this loot. So it does look like they have decent loot in them. Ship core stats. I have no idea what that is, but... um, Oh, man. We got health packs. All right. Let's just get rid of these repair kits for right now. These guys actually do drop loot. Looks like there's a couple more over there. I'm wondering if we can get in that building. I doubt it. Now, okay. I'm not going to jump in the lava. I really want to see what would happen, but that would be an absolutely stupid idea. I'm not a robot like these guys. All right, so here we are back. You know what? Let's close down some of these things. I will keep the turret on because obviously we could utilize that. So that closes down that. I'm getting used to the energy system here. We're going to turn that off. Storage will keep on. All right, so we got lots of ore and whatnot, though. So that's good. We actually are going to need some more coal. So maybe I should go out again and look for some of that stuff. Be a good idea to get the raw resources that we need early on. And you know what? I'll just keep these things inside here. And, yeah, you never know when we'll need some plates. Let's just get some inventory space before we go out. Okay, so we got seven minutes. I'm not going to go too far away from here. Now, I've noticed coal's more near the coastline. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we got guys down here, too. Is this all coal here? Damn! I, I, I got real lucky if we got coal right beside us, though. And robot dudes are not bothering me just yet, so I'm not going to bother them if we don't need to. Now, I noticed... Well, I mean, it was obvious that the captain's ship was in the water, so I'm wondering if we can get kind of submarine ships later on as well, or if we can turn this thing into a submarine, because that would be really, really cool. Okay, let's see how good it is. All right, looks like I did miss once. There we go. Uh, so yeah, decent range on these things. There we go. Let's get some loot off of these guys, because obviously, these are not bad at all. It's always nice to get some extra resources, scrap metal, more breach replacements, so these are all good things that we'll use over time. And now I can mine in peace and get as much coal ore as I can hold, because we got... I mean, just coal ore after coal ore on this beach. Okay, and being that we're by this building, I'm assuming it's like the other buildings that we've seen and we can't get in here. Oh, we got scrap metal copper. Perfect. I haven't been able to find much copper, so we'll get some of that scrap metal. Uh, but like I said, I'm assuming uh, this is like the other buildings that we saw where we can't get inside. Uh, looks like inventory's full. Good problem to have, though. Let me actually see, though. You never know. Yeah, that's too bad. I wonder... I hope they add that later. We gotta remember, this is... Uh, early access version of this game, so maybe we can explore those later on? I hope we can. All right, but let's get back to our ship. We got five minutes, and we got lots of resources now. All right, and we'll throw this stuff in the storage. So yeah, we got so much coal ore. We should be totally fine now. We should probably refine some of this stuff, which I will do as we uh, go throughout this, but I do got to radio the captain to see what we have to do next. Breach replacement. We'll put those in there. Scrap metal. All right, so radio time. Let's go radio the captain. 
Prepare for attack. That's right. We need to make grenades, medkits, and shotgun slugs because uh, looks like we're going to be fighting some people. So we already fought some people, so we know they're not really that strong, but we might have some harder guys to deal with. All right, so right now we need to make some copper plates, copper bolts, and whatnot. We should probably refine some stuff real quick first, so we are going to do that. Uh, online storage not available. Okay, so online storage. Oh, my module not open. Okay. All right, eruptions coming, so we should probably get downstairs. I need to, uh, it looks like I need to deploy the power module, so I don't think we can do anything while we're underground, unfortunately, but I don't want to make the risk of, uh, staying up here and being occupied. We still got all these little guys running away from my place, too, so I thought I killed most people around here, but clearly not. Maybe we can move to a different location as well. That's always fun. And there she blows, and this time we actually get the effect. By the way, I like that it looks like a nuke. I don't know, I've never actually thought about that, but I've never seen a volcano erupt. I've seen it like smoke over, but not actually erupting, but I doubt it would look like that. Anyways, now we can, once this uh, smoke goes away, we can go back up and uh, get back to doing this. So we have to refine, one thing I'm confused by though is I'm having a problem. Well, let me just show you when we go up. Okay, refinery station says no material, which is really confusing me because if we go to my storage bay here, we have the copper scrap metal, which is used in refinery to obtain copper ingot. Now, if we go into the refinery, we can't actually make it with, for whatever reason, the copper scrap. So I have to actually go get copper ore. All right, that's fine. We just need to go find some copper out here. And that might be a little difficult though. I haven't actually seen much copper nodes around here. But yeah, we'll go for a little walk and see what we can find now that it's kind of more open as well. I mean, everything's dead. Okay, I'm actually looking for some copper around here. I cannot find any of the nodes. So we're gonna go back to uh, target one, which was the original location we went to, cause, only because I know there's copper around it. Uh, I don't want to go any further into the world either in case crazy things happen, and I really do want to do this prepare for attack quest just to see the kind of enemies we can expect. I don't know if it's all going to be the same as those little guys that we've seen already, but uh, yeah, I'm excited about this, but I need to go get copper, so can't find any here, so we're going back to the main place. And look at that, right by our ship, we got some nice copper ore, so no big deal at all. You do gotta, I like this, you gotta travel the world to find some of the resources. It's not all around everywhere, so certain commodities have their own unique locations, it seems like. Uh, but yeah, we should be able to get a lot of copper here, so I'll obviously collect a little bit of it right now, because we're gonna need a lot of that. Okay, so we got some copper, let's refine this really quickly and finally get these copper tubes that we desperately need. So, it looks like everything should be on production station, no, we need the refinery. Ah, uh, that's right, we need to obviously put it in the inventory first, so... It looks like it's already producing it because I queued up a bunch of it, so perfect. So, I'm having an issue though, uh, it says that the, um... Where is it? The copper scrap metal can be used in the refinery to obtain copper ingots? Uh, that's not the case right now, because I've had these and I haven't been able to use them, so we still need the copper ore, unfortunately, to do that. Let's, uh, queue up some more of this since we have a lot of things to refine. Hell, we have some sulfur we can probably refine as well. Gotta love a good grenade, so we can produce, we need five grenades, so this will come in handy for sure. And these are obviously handheld grenades. I didn't know if I was putting them on my turret or what. I hope we have enough turret ammo, by the way, as well. Produce med kits. So, once again, in tools, we have lots of health packs already, but I guess it's just teaching us where these things are. And shotgun ammo, which is in the ta tab ammo, and we got some slugs. So, there we go. Pick explosives from storage, and it looks like I already got the med kits and everything, so all we need is the explosives. All right, it's always a good day when you have grenades to play with. Let's bring these slugs out, too. I'm not sure why they were in my inventory. See, we got lots of health packs, so we got, like, stacks of them. So we're doing okay for our inventory right now. I'm taking my time. Uh, contact the captain. All right, do we want to attack them here? You know what? I'm fine for here. Let's contact him. Lava source. It's time to let the cogs know they are not alone in this island. I kind of already introduced myself to them, to be fair, but okay. Travel to the lava cave and destroy the laser drill ship? Holy crap, dude, you're putting a lot of trust in me right now. Make sure you brought enough grenades to take it out quickly. Destroy all modules at the base of the crane, and it will collapse. So obviously, we're mid between an eruption right now. We'll take the time to uh, prepare to attack, and then we're going to go in. So, oh, I didn't accept it. We'll definitely accept that quest. All right, so yeah, we're at the lava source. So that's like the actual head volcano. Well, actually, it looks like there's 
three different volcanoes on this island. Wow, we're in a triangle of volcanoes. Oh, and I'm one right in the middle that I didn't even notice. So we're going to Lava Source 1. Doesn't look like it matters 10 or 11. They're all spread out, so we'll just probably do 10. So we have some time to kill. Let's uh, play with this ship core stats. I'm assuming this is a placeable. So if we... Oh, yeah, look at that. Okay, so what does it do, though? Oh, it just tells us the hull, the balance, the core slots. Isn't that what our energy thing says? No, it looks like... Oh, no, actually, that's exactly it. So we don't really need that, actually, because uh, we already have one. So I was just curious what that thing was. Now we know. It's the it's the energy thing, and I guess it has more information. I'm not sure. Balance is how much energy I'm using and how much energy I'm taking. It looks like the hull is maybe the amount of slots I have around, and I've used them all. I'm not sure, though. That's just what I'm thinking. One thing we probably should make more of is the turret ammo. I'm not sure how much we need. I have 10 right now. It looks like each one has 50 bullets, but being that we have lots of supplies right now, let's make a few more of these and make sure we're always safe at our base. It might be smart to get another turret tower as well. Uh, looks like I actually used... Oh, wow. That took a lot of resources, I think, because I just used up everything. All right, that's fine. Let's actually go see what I'm using. Okay, my storage is actually maxed. That's a problem as well. I didn't realize that would be so easy. Okay, so I don't think we can, unless we upgrade it, because this is tier one. I think there's a way to upgrade it. I'm getting way too far ahead of myself, though. Obviously, I'm a new player. Uh, we can always use these side storages. We have an eight storage slot here. I think I'll throw anything that I use in this. All right, so I think I'm ready to go. We're going to have to travel. I'm not sure if because we're going a further distance, it's going to take some time, but we're going to target 10, and you know what I'm going to do? Let's change it to underground being that the volcano is going to erupt here. Uh, let's travel over there. We'll wait for the volcano to erupt, and then we'll reach the surface and attack this place. This sounds exciting, though. I mean, we're actually going to destroy, hopefully, one of their vehicles. All right, we're traveling right now. I wonder what we see if we look up when we're traveling. Is it still... Okay, it doesn't move, unfortunately, with us. I wish the movement was a little bit cooler, because it's, it's hard to tell what's going on in here. Obviously, you can see dirt out there, but that's about it. Uh, but I wish it was more like what we were actually in a moving vehicle, you know? Definitely taking a lot longer to get there, though, so I'm glad we left when we did because, yeah, this there is real travel times in this. Oh, we do have a work table. I was looking at this earlier. Uh, so we can actually build on the work table while we're down here. I don't have any resources to build in, but it's cool that you can build basic equipment here, basically. All right, sounds like we made it as well. Let's see what we're looking at. Wow! Okay, are we going to be coming up right here? This is obviously maybe the thing we have to attack. I can't even see the volcano going on. we still got two minutes, though, so we're going to wait some time here. And, uh, yeah, it looks like we're actually, like, deep underground almost. Like, that is amazing. So we're attacking inside of a volcano. I'm not seeing many creatures around, so that's good. I don't know what that thing is right in front of us, but... Yeah, I didn't expect to be inside of a cave. Oh, there she goes. Just doing some uh, building while we're waiting. This work table, I kind of like this. It's slower than the uh, refinery or the production table, but at least you can do it underground. Now it is time to get up anyways. I figured we'd build, just in case, another one of these. Two times sulfur powder. I got to go grab that. Being that we don't have online inventory en enabled right now, I got to do everything on my own. I know in one of these, yeah, we should have sulfur powder. No big deal. Figured I'd make one more grenade or two, just in case I miss, you know. Just trying to prepare ahead a little bit here, so there we go. We got a, gr we got a grenade. All right, let's do it. Let's go up. Oh, God, this is not creepy at all. Okay, so that thing's gone. What the hell is that over there, though? Okay, is that, like, mining? That is so cool. So I think that's the crane it was talking about that we have to destroy. I don't really remember how it wanted me to do it, though, so I hope it tells me. Okay, destroy all modules at the base of the crane. Use grenades to destroy them quickly. If you ran out of ammo, use pickaxe. Okay, so it looks like we just gotta go destroy this thing. Man, we are really gonna get a war going, aren't we? Like, this captain, man, he's being pretty aggressive. <laughs> These guys haven't really bothered me, to be fair, but hey, the captain helped me out, so I'm gonna come and take this thing out. My god, this is epic. Okay, so, so we got sulfur here. Just looking for resources for later because we know you know we're gonna need some more of this stuff. So I'm thinking we should just move right to the grenade. And oh Jesus! No, I didn't want to throw two. Okay, I think that was. I think I screwed up there. I think I'm supposed to destroy those. You know what? Let's go up and just pickaxe it. Being that nobody's here, I'm totally cool with mining this thing. I, I'm assuming this is how to destroy it, right? 
was that noise? Oh god! There's robots coming! There we go! Okay, so that was it. I'm not crazy. Okay, so we gotta destroy all these things. We definitely should have made more grenades. Like, I used like three on that thing. Oh god, here we go. Alright. Got those guys down. How are we gonna get to these other sides? Do we gotta... I don't feel comfortable going through that lava. I think we gotta go around the long way. Alright, trying to figure out... God, this is dangerous. Uh, how the hell we're supposed to get over to the other side? I think maybe I can go this way? Alright, screw it. Uh, I hope I can get back up. Uh, because, yeah, this guy's, like, on three platforms. So, I think I went the wrong way, didn't I? Uh, maybe I can climb up here. It's hard to tell, man. This is a giant cave. Okay, I think this is good. We got some robots over here to deal with in a little bit. Those are some huge sulfur nodes as well. Aw, oh, man, I should have reloaded! Gotcha! Long range shot there. Okay, so those guys shouldn't bother me now. So, yeah, there's not many robots here. I'm actually impressed. Oh, God. All right, well, today we learn if there's fall damage or not. Oh, never mind. Oh, Jesus. Hello. Oh, that was an awful aim. He doesn't even know I'm here, though. He didn't know where I was. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now I think we're going to have to rush a little bit. So let's try to do this. Okay, so it does take two. That was way better than last time. I don't know why the other one took so long to take down. I think this is probably going to be one we need to hit as well. There we go. Oh, I love it. We actually destroyed the wall as well. I'm so nervous about this lava. I don't know how much it's going to take to destroy me. There we go. So we got that. We fully destroyed Crane 2. So I guess there was more on that other crane that I was at. I just didn't see it. Oh my god, I'm so nervous around fire. This is awful. This is this is, this is is horrifying for me. Oh, what's up, man? I don't know if you're on my team or not. I hope you are because you're much bigger. Look at that. It's like a caterpillar. So it looks like you can add on rooms to your original room. There's too many things around me. I'm, I'm feeling uncomfortable. We're going we're gonna to go do what we, we got to do. Oh, wow. That was one hit. Oh, no. We got a turret. Watch out for the turret. Uh, destroy it by grenades. That's something I should have done. Okay, so we're going to heal ourselves. Wow, healing takes a while. Uh, how the hell am I going to deal with this guy now? We might have to come back and re-attack. I've, I've learned that five grenades is not enough. I'm going to give it my best shot, though. We got a lot to take down here, but maybe if we go underground, it will still save it. Uh, and then we just got to come back and kill what, what whatever we left. I doubt it works that way, though, so we might need to go make a bunch of grenades. Okay, so there we go. We got that. Now, can we get inside yet? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm stuck. Oh, no! Okay, okay. I thought I was stuck there for forever. Okay, that's always scary when you get stuck in games, man. Um, I wonder if I can sneak around. Oh. Is he hit me? Yep, he is definitely hitting me. Ow, this is... I don't think I'm going to be able to take this thing down, man. I should have got the turret first. I didn't realize it was on this one. Looks like it's reloading. Did it run out of ammo? Did it not prepare either? It's not shooting me, so I think I think we're okay. Yes! Oh, no! No, I wasn't even hitting it! Oh, this is bad. Okay. Yep. This is not good at all. Oh, it's actually slow, though. I might be able to kite this thing. I'm learning its weaknesses as I attack it. So we're running out of healing kits, though. Oh, I didn't mean to use two. Let's keep this going. Oh, no, not again. I did it again! I did it again! Oh, hello. What's going on, man? How you doing? Okay, nine minutes left. Nine minutes left. We need to take this thing out. I'm gonna try and waste some of these shots, see if we can shoot it to death. Uh, doesn't look like it's really being bothered by me right now. We might actually... If we run up... What? It, okay! I'll take it! I think it ran out of ammo for sure this time. There. We. Go. Okay, Crane 2's done. Turret's done. Now we just need the other leg. I can't believe I missed that one. Okay, so I gotta rush back. Uh, looks like there's only... Wait, what am I missing here? Am I supposed to destroy this? Oh, I think I am. There we go. So, yeah, I think I gotta destroy the armor as well. So now I gotta... Oh, God. Here we go. Gotcha. All right. Thankfully, these guys are pretty easy to deal with. All right. I gotta get all the way around this freaking place, though. And I jumped down from here, I think, so... This is gonna be real close. Drill ship under attack? Oh, this is not a good time for that. This is not... Oh my god. Okay. Um, good thing I didn't go any further. That was really, really close. Ah, uh, what do I do now? I, I got a predicament. I, I need to finish this job. I need to finish this job. We'll worry about the drill ship later. We still got five minutes. And all we need to do is destroy Crane 1, which is this one right here, I believe. Problem is, we got lots of guys around, as you can see. Okay, I literally have to jump across lava. This is scary. I'm doing it! Oh! Oh! Oh, no! Are you... Are you serious? The lava boss got me? Wait, 
I have lost the game. No, I haven't lost the game. We're going to load that game or pretend that didn't happen. All right, I took another way back over here. We had to go actually a further way, but I didn't have to deal with the lava this time, and I'm not very good at jumping across that. I have noticed my turret doing a great job supporting my ship, though, so that's good. And we got five minutes. I, I got to assume we're okay. All we got to do is take down this and the main leg, and we are good to go. So the only thing that got me was the lava. I'll take it, man. I feel pretty good about myself. Actually, let's not get too far ahead of myself. I am low health right now. I probably should have used that health kit, but I just want to get this done as quickly as possible because I don't know what's going to happen after we take this thing down. I want to get underground and go hide. So yeah, the more I play this game, the more I find that the, uh, the, the quests give you the bare minimum of what you need. So if you're going to go fight something in this game that a quest gives you, you probably should make some extra ammo and whatnot. This would have been extremely easy if we made maybe three to four times the amount of grenades that I actually made. They're not really that expensive either, so definitely worth it to prepare and fortify before you get here. Okay, de deactivate the enemy drill ship. Um, I, okay, did it. I didn't do anything, but I deactivated it. Does it actually fall? Well, it's definitely not there anymore, so we took it down! So our first lava cave, gotta say, I didn't expect it to be so damn epic. But yeah, all we've seen is that one little robot. I gotta assume there's gonna be some bigger guys out here, or maybe it's just a bunch of small little guys that we gotta deal with. I have no idea. But I think that's a good time to wrap up this one. First episode was all about building, second episode was mostly about fighting. And yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this game. Now, obviously, it'll be continuing to go. I need to contact the captain again to see what we do next. And we'll wait for the next episode to check that out. So thank you so much for watching and liking, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.